Good morning, guys. <laughs> so it's now May 26 in Cebu and Guayo. We're here in Orhelio. We're going home. <laughs> so the vaccination is Guana. In Cebu is at its full swing. They just uh, drove my wife to a vaccination center where she is one of the, uh, she's part of the vaccination team. So, ang trabaho sa mga doctor is really to interview. They're not the ones gonna be injecting the vaccine, but yeah, they're the ones evaluating the people who are asking for some vaccination. And uh, so it's funny sometimes, like in a one, yeah, karon it's A1 to A3, so from frontliners to to call it mga mga seniors and also people with comorbidities so mani ang kwal lang it's um, there are a lot of people na na comorbidities na na priority mo like mga hypertensive to mga taso cholesterol kanang especially the diabetes especially the people who are taking medication na nanglan kung namoy gibintay na tambal for certain kanang long term na sakit you're actually qualified now to kuan um, all you need to do is a certificate uh, to get is a certification from your doctor and also you know the mga resita mga mga kuan prescription of your medicines pakita lang and you are qualified to be vaccinated ASAP <laughs> so why not <laughs> and why not? today is a morning it's already 8 o'clock here in Cebu and we'll see because it's almost really back to normal it's nothing it's <laughs> We don't. Uh, we're MGCQ for months already, and practically all jobs or all important jobs, except mga tingali ng mga bars and mga mga diskuhan. But everything is back. <laughs> so even the traffic is back. But early morning, what pagitan yung traffic? Uh, so we're going towards. Wednesday, so then again, so we're just gonna turn right there in Candido Padilla. I turn left in Candido Padilla.
Cologne. Eh. Yeah, we're on our way to Cologne. Which is swan. Dala na to sa Kabixi this morning. Wala gya po'y klase mga bata. And I think technically it's vacation naman tingi sa uban. But no na, wala gya po'y kuan face to face classes. Dili sa ato ah. Although I think mga kalo mga nagdoktor are now or mga special mga interns and PGIs are now can now go to the hospitals and most of our frontliners once at noon are quite are vaccinated already so delay <laughs> one na surprising if they are out and about I mean go on busy na go on ang mga tao na pwede na get and cases in Cebu has been has been down since mga after that spike way back in February and March been go on na medyo go on na go on na get we're Nagkanya po nagpasuwa magpa-test but it's when it comes to positivity rate it's not as fun it's not alarming anymore I'm not saying what ng virus this the virus is still there and we are we have to be careful gapon now we're in Cologne Street na sa iyo pas buntag so don't expect much now but busy na sad since it's 8 na so na na yung mga nangabrig yung rong urasa and it's time to report for work for many people Cologne Esquina Juana Osmania and Cologne so it's, I mean Osmania Boulevard and Cologne it's one of the busiest kind of crossing street one of Shibuya pero due to the pandemic sa dili na kayo daghan rin ang labang but normally yes kung especially napani klase yeah, then especially in the afternoon napani mga nagsiga na billboards it's like our own, yeah, Times Square and Sibuya. This is our Cologne Square. <laughs> so, lamang kaya labang. But yes. <laughs> Ano 
Fair Farm ang kuhaan niyo tag niya So that's our Quran marker If you turn left, it's Parian If you turn right, it's go, We're going to Manong Tadre sa Cathedral Ang Santo Nino Here, finally. So it's a gloomy weather right now in Cebu. Um, I don't know, but it's like, it's like the end of summer, na ba? <laughs> it's been raining for the past couple of days. Quite quan. Um, basa na sa weather. Although, yeah, we expect na pohon na nasa di mga bagyo in a few weeks. We expect mga typhoon season na sa. Pero yeah, so aman sa na worry ka ayo kasi kids are staying at home, doing their modules and online classes lang yun. Ano ni? Here, na nato sa Patria de Cebu Tapos Kaan? Cathedral Gaya ng mga bante, mga sakyanan Going to Santo Nino na ta. This is Santo Nino na complex. Although we are not going there, we're gonna turn left towards Plaza Independencia. Kaya padung na ta sa tapuan. BC sa dron na makomelek. Yes, it's elections na sa next year so kung wala pa mo, kailangan mo mo balhin um, balhin o you know, balhin o butar or if you wanna update your your voters uh, voting status kailangan ka mo balhin o address or for example yung mga bago bata na who just turned 18 pwede na mo parehistro to become a voter para maka maka help mo decide for next set of leaders na sa so kinsa may mga gidungog ninyo na managan it's gonna be for me lang it's gonna be an exciting election season because matter what yeah after 6 years of President Duterte will there be another six years of another Duterte. Kasi nandung o grun daghan kayo sa service. Daghan gunong ganahan. Ni Davao City Mayor Sara Duterte na mungkupan mo dagan sa pagka presidente. So kinsa kay makiksangka niya. Mo dagan ka si you know, pampansang ka ba o Senator Manny Pacman Pacquiao so, isa pa isa kay ipadagan sa opposition would it be Lenny Robredo will she run will she run for a national position you know, after becoming a vice president I don't know what's the next step if you were if you were her pareho ba ka ni Noli Di Castro na kuha na lang mo you know mo go back na lang sa iyang atong sa pagka-broadcaster would it be you know like atong upa na si Era for example who run as president may nidaog siya but nasa tayo ko ah nasa binay for example wala siya mag 
silbi o di ba uh, vice president siya sa panahon ni Noynoy para pagdagan niya wa siya uh, wa siya kadaog ni ang dog si Davao City Mayor now president Rodrigo Duterte di ba so we will find out we will find out it's gonna be an exciting election season in the Philippines and Onang, if ever wak pa makarehistro, well, you better update or kwan, or kana wak na makabuto ba kana, dapat mabuto mo yung consecutive eh, elections, di ba? Normally, uh, para lang dili mapapas mo pangan. And I don't know, onang, you check, or kung ganahan ka mo balhin ng barangay, barangay balhin ng sudan ka, labi na karo na lisod ibiyahe, di ba? Nasa iban mo, malihin na lang Barangay kay To get benefits Like Like ka ng mga senior citizens, di ba? Na ganahan sila Na may ibang siyudad Na Naging maayong beneficyo Sa mga seniors Sama sa in a way Cebu City Na may mga 1,000 pesos Aman para seniors Uban, uban, uban pa <laughs> Brown na ni Nato <laughs> So, ano ni Ron? Na Nato sa Sirhing Osmania Boulevard And we're just crossing um, There is a General Maxillum Avenue heading towards Kona Karang SM area in Mandawe So mga na guys, thank you so much for watching and listening Karang nakabiyahi-biyahi na sa Tagbalik can see the ones that uh, you know Cebu roads are busier nowadays um, although wakay takikita ka ng grabe na traffic in the, the streets that we passed uh, by but wala. well this is like one this is pretty normal traffic na and um, save for you know wala yung mga sudyante um Parang gina, usahay, magdaghan yun ang tao sa dalan kung na ito mga elementary, high school o college students. So, naku, gina, na chunk ang nawasan sa dalan na, na potential na kita unta sa itong mga jeepney driver o mga taxi drivers. So, mga guys, thank you so much for watching. And I hope to see you na sa itong mga sunod na biyahe. Bye-bye-bye!